Welcome to Avid Media Composer Tips and Tricks. I'm Michael Krulik, and today's tip is add track. That's inserting a track to an existing timeline. So you may have several different ways that you go about doing this. You can go in and select clips in a sequence and move them up and down in the timeline by using Move Clip, which can be mapped to a key. Uh, you can also go in and you know select your tracks you know to the right or to the left and move them up and down by clicking and dragging but you are potentially moving things out of sync so there's a feature that has been in the software for years that you may not know about now typically when you go to add a track on the pc you hold down control on the mac you hold down command and with a y you're adding a new video track and with u you're adding a new audio track well, if you add a modifier to that, which is Option or Alt, you get Add Track. Here you can go in and choose the track type that you would like to add, whether it's audio or video or even data. And you also can choose the track number. Now, if you didn't know, recently we added 64 tracks of video. So 64 tracks of video or 64 tracks of audio. But if I want to insert a new V1, when I hit OK, it's going to prompt me that the track already exists. Well, it does. And it says, do you want to cancel or would I like to insert? If I select insert, watch what happens to the timeline as all of the edits move up to V2 on up. And I have a clean V1, which will allow me to drop in another clip that makes a very nice background behind my beautiful world video right here. So really easy being able to go in multiple ways to add tracks but being able to insert a track in your timeline by just holding down the option or alt modifier lets you add it quickly and easy to your sequence so quick media composer tips and tricks adding a track thanks for joining